Hello again everybody. Today I'm going to show you a really easy, great card trick and tutorial. I'll be announcing the winners of the signed deck giveaway from my last video. Plus I'll be giving away six decks of the black and the raspberry mint cards that were created by my friend Asad of 52 cards. These are beautiful cards. They're actually a mark deck. It's a very subtle marking system. I love the borders. They're almost perfect. We have a Joker. There's another Joker, but it has a Queen of Hearts on the back. The deck also comes with a double back card. The Ace of Spades is really cool. I love all the Aces. They have large pips, which looks really nice. The cards just handle smoothly. I'm going to be giving away three black, three raspberry, and you guys are going to love this deck. There's a link in the description where you can purchase the decks. And there's also a link that shows the marking system on the deck. Now let's get into the card trick and tutorial. Okay, so I'm going to be using the raspberry cards. And what I'd like you to do, well, first let me give the cards a couple of cuts. And you're going to be able to select a card that you like, but we're going to create a card. And my prediction is right over here. So what I mean by create a card is I'm going to spread the cards out and you can stop me wherever you like and point to whatever card you want. So let's say you point right over here to that card. So we'll take this card and we'll take the card right after it and we'll set the rest of the deck down on top of my prediction. Now these are the two cards you stopped me at. You pointed to this one and this was the next card. So now it's up to you to decide you're going to create a card. Do you want this card to represent the value or the suit? And the same question for this card, the value or the suit. So let's say you want this card to represent the value, this card to represent the suit. So let's take a look. The value of the card is a nine and the suit of the card is a diamond, the nine of diamonds. And now let's take a look at my prediction. My prediction says your card will be the 12th card. And if we count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and the 12th card is the 9 of Diamonds. Okay, so this trick uses a stack deck called the Psy Steven Stack. Many of you may know this, but I'm going to go through it really quickly. The cards are set up in chased order. Chase being clubs, hearts, spades, diamonds. C-H-S-D and they increase in intervals of three all the way through the deck. Let me show you how you can set it up. We'll take the clubs and we'll have them down, king down through ace, move the ace on top. We'll take ace two, three, four, move that to the top. Again, these are king down through ace and we'll go ace through seven, move that on top. And we'll go ace through ten and move that on top. So we have ace, four, seven, ten, and now we're going to stack the deck. I'll go a little fast. So, ace of clubs, four of hearts, seven of spades, ten of diamonds. King of clubs, three of hearts, six of spades, nine of diamonds. Queen of clubs, two of hearts, five of spades, eight of diamonds. Jack of clubs, ace of hearts, four of spades, seven of diamonds. Ten of clubs, king of hearts, three of spades, six of diamonds. Nine of clubs, queen of hearts, two of spades, five of diamonds. Eight of clubs, jack of hearts, ace of spades, four of diamonds, seven of clubs, ten of hearts, king of spades, three of diamonds. Six of clubs, nine of hearts, queen of spades, two of diamonds, five of clubs, eight of hearts, jack of spades, ace of diamonds, four of clubs, seven of hearts, ten of spades, king of diamonds, three of clubs, six of hearts, nine of spades, queen of diamonds, two of clubs, five of hearts, eight of spades, jack of diamonds. You now set up. What I did was a couple of false cuts. So one cut was the helix cut and then this was the clumsy shuffle. This doesn't mess up the order of the cards. Then you have your prediction right over here. You can have the spectator point to a card. Let's say they point right over here. You're going to cut the deck and set it on top of the prediction and you know this is the value and this is the suit. So, if they say they want this to be the value and this to be the suit, then you say the Ace of Clubs and you can say my prediction was your card will be the 12th card down and you can count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 and the 12th card is the Ace of Clubs. Let's say that they say they want this card to be the value and this card to be the suit. So you turn over and say, all right, so your card is the four of diamonds. 
Now what you do is you say, let's take a look at our prediction. You flip over the entire deck, and the prediction reads, your card will be the 12th card. You set the prediction to the side, so having the prediction card underneath the deck allows you to flip over the whole deck, and now if they said this card first, that becomes the value. You turn the whole deck over, this is your prediction, and you say the 12th card will be the four of diamonds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and the twelfth card is the four of diamonds. Then you can take the cards for ace and put the deck away. It's really amazing no matter where you stop, this is the value, this is the suit, if the cards go from the top down, and if they say this is the value and this is the suit, then you flip it over and it'll be either the 12th card from the bottom or the 12th card from the top. You don't have to set the deck up more than once. Have a deck designated for this trick. It will amaze people. Let me know what you guys think. Now on to the prize giveaway. Here are the winners of the Sign Bicycle decks from my last video. Winner of a blue Sign Bicycle deck goes to... Toasty Plays. Winner of a red Sign Bicycle deck goes to... Abhishek Adita. Winner of a turquoise sign deck goes to Chaser Burger. Winner of a black sign bicycle deck goes to Injustice Gamer. Winner of a fuchsia sign deck goes to Alan Almeida. Winner of a purple sign deck goes to Leo Lesio. Winner of a green sign bicycle deck goes to James Swartz. And winner of the ghost deck goes to Mayhin567. This time I'm giving away six launch edition decks of the Black Mint and the Raspberry Mint decks. All you have to do is leave a comment below, like the video, subscribe to my channel, and I'll be announcing the winners in my next video, which will be next week. Good luck to everybody. That's it. I'll see you next time.